click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, now in this topic I am going to talk about the oxidizing property of KM04 in neutral medium. We also understand that KM04 is a very strong oxidizing agent but the reaction is different based on the different medium. So in this topic I am going to talk about the oxidizing property of KM04 in neutral medium. In the next topic I am going to talk about in alkaline medium and in the further topic I am going to talk about in acidic medium. So therefore there are different reactions and based on that I am going to start with this topic. So now let's get started. <music> So friends, now I'm going to talk about the oxidizing property of KM04 that is potassium per magnet in, in neutral medium. So in that case, basically, suppose if I'm talking about that is KM04 and suppose if KM04 is dissolved in water, that is two moles of KM04 is dissolved in water, that is, and obviously we understand that is H2 is basically a neutral compound. So based on that, the following product that is what we could get is we could get that is three moles of KOH, that is potassium hydroxide along with that of that is two moles of MnO2 that is manganese dioxide and this is the main thing that is what we could get is three moles of nascent oxygen atom and based on this three moles of nascent oxygen atom the KM4 where it produces three moles of nascent oxygen atom and suppose if this three moles of nascent oxygen atom is treated with other molecules for example that is suppose if I are considering that is two moles of KM4 and suppose if we are treating it with MnSO4 that is manganese sulfate along with that of that is the water so therefore this is the condition that is what I have mentioned over here so therefore we have to balance the reaction so in this case the balance of the reaction will be in such a manner that is 3 moles of MnSO4 it will be used along with that of 2 moles of H2O so as to obtain the byproducts that is so here it is the main product that I am going to talk about that is 5 moles of MnO2 that is manganese dioxide along with that of K2SO4 that is potassium sulfate and 2 moles of H2SO4 so this is the reaction when it proceeds whenever we are talking about the oxidizing property of KM4. So here basically KM4 whenever it reacts with H2O so it forms three nascent oxygen atoms and that is how basically MnSO4 is basically oxidized to MnO2 and that's the reason that this is a reaction which shows that KM4 is a very strong oxidizing agent and that's it. So therefore this was nothing but the reaction of oxidizing property of KM4 in neutral medium and that's it. So thank you friends for watching this video. I hope I'll see you next time. Till then, don't forget to subscribe to channel. Thank you so much.